friends, I'm Constance Mickelman, the Family Ministry Director here at Bethlehem Lutheran Church. We are thrilled to welcome you to 2020 Virtual VBS, where God is at work, within us, among us, and through us. We are so excited to welcome you in this new way, and we hope that this feeds you and your family spirit. Our theme for day one is God Creates. What's your favorite thing God created? Hmm. Mine would have to be candy, pools and oceans, and my niece Piper. Today, our story is from Genesis, and we learn about when God created the world and all of the days and steps it took. Let's get into the story and learn. Before God created the world, there was nothing at all except God. On the first day of creation, the wind of God blew. Whoosh, whoosh, swoosh, God said. Let there be light. Crackle, crackle, boom, bang. There was light. God saw that the light was good. Then, split! God divided the light and the darkness into day and night. On the second day, God said, Let there be a sky. Pillow, billow, puff. There was a sky. God saw that the sky was good. On the third day, God said, Let there be water and dry land. Drip. Drop, kerplunk, there was water. Crackle, crunch, snap, there was dry land. God saw the water and land were good. Then God said, let there be plants and trees. Rumble, rustle, pop, there were plants and trees. God saw that the plants and trees were good. On the fourth day, God said, let there be a sun and moon and stars. Glimmer, shimmer, shine! There was a sun and a moon and thousands of stars. God saw that the sun and the moon and the stars were good. On the fifth day, God said, let there be sea animals that swim and birds that fly. Wiggle, splish, splash. There were sea animals. Flutter, putter, tweet. There were birds. God saw that the sea animals and birds were good. On the sixth day, God said, let there be animals of every kind on the earth. Growl, prowl, snort. There were animals with fur. Skitter, scatter, croop. There were bugs. Slither, slink, hop. There were reptiles. God saw that the animals and bugs and reptiles were good. Then God said, let there be people on the earth. Blink, wink, hiccup. There were people on the earth. God saw that the people were very good. On the seventh day, God said, it is time to rest. <sighs> God and all of creation rested. And now it's time for crafts with Hannah and Renee. And welcome to craft time. <laughs> so today, the lesson is God creates. And what are we going to be doing? We're going to be creating our own animals, just like, you know, who? God. Yes. Created our animals. So grab some Play-Doh and let's make some animals. Let's get to it. What do you think you're going to create today, Hannah? You might just go for a simple dog, you know? Good old classic animal. You love dogs. Yeah. Is there a specific type of dog? I don't think I'm not skilled. <laughs> <laughs> What's your favorite type of dog? 
Oh, definitely a husky. Huskies are so cute. They are. Mm -hmm. My favorite. I like great dogs. I like great dads. Me too. They're so cute. I once saw a child ride on one like a horse. <laughs> That's no good. <laughs> <laughs> What are you gonna make, Renee? I don't know. I'm gonna see where inspiration takes me. Oh, nice. Yes. I'm gonna make a new animal today. Ooh. I just had a great idea. What if I just made a snake? <laughs> Do it. <laughs> Snakes are good animals. They are. They're very cute. You can be a little spooky, but we love them. <laughs> All dogs are unique in their own way. It's true. You can have a red dog with blue ears, because why not? Yeah, God loves us no matter what, no matter what you look like. Yeah. <laughs> What are you gonna name your dog? Play-Doh. <laughs> Very original. I know, thank you. Mm. Thank you. I feel like this is kind of turning into a cat. No. It's okay. It's up to the imagination. Yeah. Whatever it looks like, it's all good. Whatever it wants to be. Yeah. I'm gonna name my dog Blue because it has blue ears. Good. Now, is it the traditional spelling of Blue or is it like just B L U? It's gonna be B L O O. Oh! There we go. <laughs> what are you gonna name your animal? Um, that's a great question. <laughs> Spots with these spots. Very nice. Okay, should I give him blue legs or should I keep with the red? Could I make him a primary dog or cat? <laughs> Oh, there we go. Very smart. Because you know, the primary colors are red, blue, and yellow. Very good. And then yeah. you mix them all together and make new colors. We love mixing colors. Oh, yes, we do. Just make sure that you don't eat any, Renee, okay? <laughs> I won't. Good. It's not good for you, even if it is yummy. let my imagination just come out mm -hmm. and so I think I combined a hippo a giraffe just gave them some colorful spots yeah, yeah. I see it mm -hmm. very nice if you saw this out in the wilderness what would you do I think I would be pretty scared yeah <laughs> I feel like that would be a pretty big creature yeah it would be but it's okay mm -hmm. I love him just I like love God loves too. all of us Three legged. You know, he 
special. Not all of us are born the same. Yeah. And it's okay, we don't need to be. We don't need to be. Ooh, the leg's kind of coming off though. I think yours is standing up much better. <laughs> well, I gave them the little nubs. Okay. Wait, wait. Ah. Yeah! Look at that. So we got Blue, the three legged dog, or maybe a cat. And then the giraffe hippo. <laughs> and then we have Spots, the giraffe hippo. Thank you so much for coming to crafts with us today. <laughs> we have to say it again, it fell over. <laughs> with us today. We are so excited to see you next time. One, two, three! Ah! Oh, our heads went flying. Oh. Singing is one of my favorite things. Let's all sing together. Hi, friends. The theme for today is God Creates. And one of my favorite animals that God ever created was the hippo. So we're going to sing a song about it. It's called the hippo song. Repeat after me. Repeat after me. In the beginning, God made the seas. In the beginning, God made the seas. And the forest filled with trees. And the forest filled with trees. God placed the mountains up so high. God placed the mountains up so high. Above it all, God placed the sky. Above it all, God placed the sky. God's fingerprints are everywhere. God's fingerprints are everywhere. Just to show how much he cares. Just to show how much he cares. In the middle. God had some fun. In the middle, God had some fun. He made a hippo that weighed a ton. He made a hippo that weighed a ton. Hip, hip, hippopotamus. Hip, hip, hippopotamus. Hip, hip, hooray, God made all of us. Hip, hip, hooray, God made all of us. Hip, hip, hippopotamus. Hip, hip, hippopotamus. Hip, hip, hooray, God made all of us. Hip, hip, hooray, God made all of us. Got it? That's the whole song. Let's do it all together. In the beginning, God made the seas and the forest filled with trees. God placed the mountains up so high. Above it all, God placed the sky. God's fingerprints are everywhere. Just to show how much he cares. In the middle, God had some fun. He made a hippo that weighed a ton. Hip, hip, hippopotamus. Hip, hip, hooray, God made all of us. Hip, hip, hippopotamus. Hip, hip, hooray, God made all of us. That's the hippo song. Thanks for singing with us. Now we're headed to prayer time with Pastor Laura and Pastor Sam. Boys and girls, let's pray. Repeat after me. Dear God, you made everything from the butterflies to the giant whale sharks and the whole ocean. And you hold us in your hands. Help us to care for your whole creation. Amen. Hope you're hungry, because it is snack time with Roman and Sam. Hi, I'm Sam, and this is Roman, and the theme for this week is God Creates. Uh, we're here today to show you guys how to make a little paintbrush out of Rice Krispie Treats. So, first what you're going to do is you can either get Rice Krispies, you can either buy them or make them homemade. And then next, you're going to need some frosting. And then make sure you do this with an adult as well. Um, you're going to get the frosting. And you're going to scoop some out into your little cup. 
like so. Once you have that, then you can choose any food coloring that you'd like. It doesn't have to be this type, but you can do any other. What color do you want to pick? I think I'm going to choose the green one. Okay. What about you? Uh, I'll probably go with blue. Blue sounds good. Next, right. what you want to do is put a little green into the frosting, make it a little colorful. Exactly. And then stir that around. She makes her up. Alrighty, just mix it until you get the color you like. Once you got your frosting, you can get your Rice Krispie tray and with an adult, get your little, get your knife and stick a little hole in the bottom of it. So you can put your little popsicle stick in like that. And if you have enough frosting, you just stick your little popsicle stick in like so. Like so, like a little paintbrush. And you can either dip it in here and try and get it all over. And you might have to use your knife to spread it on it. So you like just this. do your thing, just spread it all over, make it look nice and neat. Nice. And here is my paintbrush. I hope you guys tried this too. It was very fun. Remember the theme is God Creates. I love games. Let's play one together now. So, welcome to games. So today, since the theme is God Creates, we are going to be playing a fun game of Animal Pictionary. So grab your family and let's get started. So, what you're going to need to start is you're going to need big pieces of paper or medium-sized pieces of paper, whatever you want to do. And you're going to need some markers and then you're going to need a bowl full of animal names. So what you're going to do is you're going to split into two teams or just do one team depending on the size of your family. And you're going to create a bunch of animal names and fold them up Put them in the bowl, and then when it's your turn, you're going to draw an animal, you're going to look at it, see what it is, and then you're going to draw it on the piece of paper. And your family's going to have to guess what you're drawing. So here we have team one. I'm Renee. I'm Roman. And we're team two, and I'm Constance. And I'm Sam. And uh, all right, so should we just get started with it? Or? Let's do it. Okay. Okay. Oh, oh okay. sorry. Oh, ah! yeah. I'll just go with it. Now, dog. Uh, horse. Horse. Yes. Oh. 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 <laughs> oh, do we just switch up every time? Yep. Yep. Okay. okay. All right. All right. So, wait. Right. So now you pick one, and then you and share. Then you share. It. Yep. Okay. Ready? All right. Let me show. Yeah, right, let's see. What? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> and go! <laughs> oh, is she gonna have to color? Um, a squid. A beaver. Um, a narwhal. A porcupine! No. Uh, um, uh, <laughs> um, <laughs> um, 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 is it a Uh, close. It's not a beaver? Is it an otter? Yes. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> uh, I got otters. <laughs> Sorry, look at mine. <laughs> I don't I don't know. Know. That's what I got. I like that. the manatee. Man, I don't know. I'm going to honor. We, we still got it though. Okay. All right. Let's go. Oh my All God. All right. <laughs> okay. All right. Three, two, one, go. Hey. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
Today. today we read about how God made the whole world and all the oceans and forests and every single animal, including whales, which are one of my favorites. And we all made our own animals. And this is my favorite animal. Isn't he cute? And we made Rice crispy paint brushes and did so much more. Please come back tomorrow because tomorrow we are going to build a boat and we're going to learn about Noah's Ark and all the animals that he brought onto the Ark, including frogs. Bye, everybody. See you tomorrow.